that's it. We're back from where did we go? Mallorca. Mallorca. We're back <laughs> from Mallorca. We had two days at home, and now we've packed up and we're all our way back to the airport again. Yep. It feels like we're doing the same thing again. It feels a bit weird. Well, we are. We're driving to the same <laughs> airport car park at the same time of day. But we are going to different terminal because this time we're off to Croatia for Tom and Jade's wedding. Yeah. So um, it's Friday today. We're going for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So we get back. Yeah. So um, yeah. But we're quite nervous about the trip today, aren't we? Yeah, because we've got <laughs> we have to book parking, and then we've got our flight to Rome, a two-hour stopover, and a flight to Croatia, and then we've got to get a bus to the ferry port. And then a ferry. The, and we're getting the last ferry as we're well. The last ferry. So, and if anything's delayed, then we're buggered. Yeah, we're scrupled. So, it's going to be uh, an exciting day. <laughs> At the moment, we're three minutes behind schedule. <laughs> but we're all right this side. All right, this We've side. got loads of time now. It's just um, everything else. Yeah, it's going to be funny because the last trip to Mallorca was with all of our family oriented friends, and then this one is all. All of the mates that haven't got kids, so it's going to be um, polar <laughs> opposite trips. Yeah. I think. But yeah, Can't we'll wait. see. So, yeah. We're really excited about going to Croatia because we've not been there before, so we're super excited, aren't we? Ryan nearly went the wrong way and I have a little freak out. Um, um, yeah, it's cool. I haven't been to a country that I've never been to for a long time. Yeah. So we are, we're super excited about that and like, it's nice to go exploring somewhere you've never been before. Which we haven't done in so long because well, obviously we used to do that all the time and we just haven't done it for so many years. Yeah, and we haven't been on actual holiday holiday no. for a long time and now we've done two in a week so it's quite cool. <laughs> Check in her pram, so to carry Indy the whole way. Wait here, mummy's on the toilet. And now um, we got to wait for our baggage because there's two flights before us. So hopefully it comes soon. So it's the next day and it all got a bit hectic yesterday with the old travel. Like we said, everything had to go smoothly for us to make it for the last ferry in time, which it didn't. We um, we got off our first flight, which was fine, went down to baggage claim, stood there waiting and the baggage claim took like 45 minutes before we got our bag. And then the pram, the push chair still hadn't come through. So we were like, shit, what are we gonna do? How long do we wait? We had two hours from landing to take off of our next flight. 45 minutes had gone past. We got our bag, no pram. So we, me and Michelle looked at each other and said, should we ditch the pram? So we did. We ditched the pram, legged it up to check in for the next flight, checked the bag in. I said to Michelle, you go through to security, go to the gate, and I'll go back down and see if the pram's there. Went back down, big old kerfuffle, trying to get back into baggage claim. 
managed to do it, get the, got the pram, ran back up, ran all the way to the gate, and we would have got, I would have got to the flight 20, 15, 20 minutes before takeoff, which was perfect. Got to the gate, delayed one hour. Fuck. So anyway, it was about an hour and a half it ended up being delayed by, so we landed late, which then meant we left, we missed the last ferry to the island. So we rang up the hotel, like, what do we do? Da -da -da. And they said, there's a car ferry. So we went to try and find that, got the car ferry, which ended up going to the other side of the island, which we didn't even know where, we've never been to this island before, so we had no clue where that was. Managed to get on that, got the car ferry, got a bus back to this town, got a taxi to the hotel, ended up here at 11 p.m. So it all worked out, finally, but it was a mission. It's one of those things, again, every time anything interesting happens, you wish you had the camera, but when interesting shit happens, you're the last thing you want to do is get the camera out. It's so hard, you just wish you had a little filmer just running around behind you. But yeah, we're here in Havar. We've had a lovely day at the pool. So yeah, it's going to be interesting. We're going out for dinner now, so I'll try and get some clips and show you around our little five day trip. Indy's been loving the pool today, which has been good. And uh, it's a bit different this time because it's not families with looking after their own kids. Everyone, no one's got kids apart from one other couple. So it's just loads of people to look after Indy, which is super fun. So um, we've been enjoying ourselves today. So yeah, we'll see what we get up to, shall we? I'll give you a little preview of the old pool vibes at the moment. The gangs have all pretty much got in and out. Do you want anything to say for me, French? Yeah, good. No, look, we're just here having a nice time. Uh, Tom and Jade's wedding in Croatia. Uh, we're just here really having a lovely time with our friends and family, which is just great to see. So, yeah, catch up on the uh, catch up on the vlog. And we'll see if this makes it to the CGG post or not, I suppose. I don't know, it was very interview based, wasn't it? Mm. Not very natural. Sorry, I don't know what you want to say. Don't say. Don't say whatever you want. Ben. <laughs> And I didn't get it on the video. <laughs> Kirk! Kirk, do it again! Give me a stand! Give me a stand! Kirk, can you do it again for the vlog, please? Kirk, can you do it again for the vlog? Give me a stand! The girls are just off on a shopping trip. <laughs> <laughs> nice little walk from the hotel, just down this, and then the town's literally down there. Absolutely perfect. This is really nice. We're just going to go for a little wonder, look around the shops, see what we can find. So I think we're on day three now, aren't we? Um, are we? No, yeah, it's Monday, we got here Friday. Yeah, and then we've got a whole day tomorrow. So we're on day three, getting up nice and early, as we're the parents. Got our fellow parent over there, look at him. Yeah. And then a nice little breakfast straight in the pool before anyone's down here, it's lovely. <laughs> Indy's actually enjoying the pool for a start. Yeah. First, for first, 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 first,
She always just wants to get in. So then we say 10 minutes in, 10 minutes off. And that's the plan. <laughs> Michelle sits there and drinks her coffee. Yeah. But today is the wedding day, so I'm gonna get gonna get my camera off Frenchie actually, because he I left my camera in Mallorca, so Rich and Tiff had to take it to their house, and then they sent it to Frenchie, and Frenchie's brought it to Croatia for us. So I'm gonna switch to the old camera this afternoon for the wedding, so we get some actual good footage instead of me slurring into the old GoPro that you can probably not hear very well. And then yeah, wedding day, buzzing for it. Bring it here. <laughs> what you got there, mate? Camera. Cheers, mate. Don't suck on that, you mate. Perfect. Oh, nice packaging, Rich. Jesus Christ. Thought you said you used to do this for a living. All the way from Mallorca. Thanks, mate. Alright, so there we are. Getting ready for the old wedding. It's wedding day. So. Me, Michelle and India just quickly getting ready. We're going to meet everyone and then go and enjoy the day. Lovely day for it. We just saw the guys, um, Tom, Jack, Ben and Rory were in their tuxes. Uh, just having a little photo shoot at the hotel and uh, it looks so good. And uh, I was just looking at the shots that the cameraman was getting. I could see his screen at the back and I was already choking up just watching that. So. Let's see if we can keep it together today.
had a really good night, got, got drunk, argued about something petty that neither of us can remember. So day after Indy, how do you feel? Do you feel okay today Indy? I'll do it all right. Yeah, cool. You have too many fruit juices, don't you? You don't want that one. I do. So I do want this one. You do want this one. Surprisingly, all right. Considering, I don't know what was going on in the room above me, but there was sound like someone was getting their head kicked. Just banging around. Furniture being banged around. Well, are you underneath? Are you underneath Omar and Nikki's room? Are you? Just shouting and screaming. <laughs> That's how Omar likes to play his games. <laughs> this is the day after we thought we'd leave the we'd leave the pool and uh, have a little venture out and see what's about. We um Obviously where we went yesterday, the venue was absolutely insane. So we have seen some really nice stuff in here, but we have been at the pool for four days as well. Yeah, so it's nice to do a little bit. Of Not that we want to, like, we, we want to be at the pool. Like, it's best for Indy and Omar and Nick are there with Ada, which is lovely for us. Yeah. So we're just going to pop out for a quick stroll. And I do really want to get in that seat because it looks unreal. popped out for a bit of lunch haven't we yeah. and we came here the other night with the boys the boys had a night and the girls had a night and the boys came here and I ordered this pasta here which is um, tagliatelle with parmesan garlic cream sauce with prawns so I said to Cheryl let's go and have it and um, we kept raving on about it so I was like right do you mind if we go to the same restaurant because I want that dish you've got and then we said to the waiter, oh, can we just have two, two of these pastas? And he goes, why don't you get one of them and another one that I recommend and then share it? Like, yeah. So we went, yeah, okay. And we love it when restaurants do that. Like mm. when the waiter says, no, actually, try this, try that. And it turns out it's just really nice when we do that. Mm. Yeah, I think this, this is our first little lunch on our own since we've been here. Yeah. And we're going on a boat trip in a minute. Yeah, very excited. With Indy's the gang. Now it's perfect, and we're all going on a boat trip. That's it. Yeah. yeah. Rib for the afternoon. Rory didn't trust me to drive it, so he, he booked the captain for us, which is nice because now I can just chill out. He's going fast! What? He's going fast! Did he? He just got an octopus, didn't he, Indy? And Indy just saw the octopus that, my, that the captain caught for us. And the good thing is, he knows all the good bays, whereas we'd be just driving around aimlessly. What are you crying for?
I'm about to take a little pit stop, a little beer pit stop. That's where Tom and Jade's uh, reception was last night. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, so once again, we forgot to end our video. Standard. But uh, this was pretty much the last day drinking rosé in this in this beach bar. So the next day, we literally just travelled home after the yeah. best week, and uh, yeah, that was all we did. It went a lot smoother on the way home than on the way there. But yeah, once again, we just want to say thanks to Tom and Jade for inviting us. It was the best week and the best ever that we've ever had. So um, yeah, thanks again, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Cheers.